Okay guys, in three, two, one, we're on the best skyblock server for Minecraft Bedrock. So it's been a while since I've been on Minecraft. Although I haven't been on the game for a bit, I've been still looking for the best seeds and best servers, and I think I came across the best one. Today we're going to be taking a look at the best skyblock server on Minecraft PS4 Bedrock Edition. Hello YouTube, welcome back to another video, and today I'm going to be showcasing the best skyblock server for Minecraft PS4 Bedrock Edition. This is also going to be working on the other Bedrock Editions, but I know PS4 doesn't really get enough love for the servers, so I decided to go ahead and show my appreciation by showing you guys a brand new skyblock server so let's go ahead and check this out i forgot to mention that you do start off with this cool starter kit i believe this is a one-time starter kit right here but as you can see i have everything on and i have my sword and i have my food as well okay so i'm gonna see if i can pvp some people so apparently this is the pvp drop off area which this looks really really cool i'm hoping nobody's down here so as you can see i was just teleported and now i can actually go ahead and kill people if i really wanted to but i believe nobody's here so if you want to go ahead and get back to spawn, you just type in the command slash spawn and, uh, hey, 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 hey. Okay, so this guy is going to kill us in one shot. Or maybe not. Is he, like, AFK? I think he's AFK, guys. Okay, let's go ahead and hit him with the... Okay, okay, we're, we're going to get him. We're going to get him. We're going to get his armor. Oh, my goodness. Crit, crit spam. Crit spam. Okay. What is this lag? Okay, I don't know what's going on with the lag. Oh, oh, he, he's looking at us. He is looking at us. So never mind then, okay. I thought we I thought we had him. Okay, if he was actually AFK, I really would have taken his armor, but that's kind of a shame. So let's go ahead and create an island. Okay, so I'm gonna go back. Oh, he was giving me No! I, he was giving me armor! No, 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 no. Okay. So I need to go ahead and get down there immediately. I legit used this last spawn command at the wrong time. Okay, that's terrible. Let me go back to the PvP arena. I'm gonna go ahead and jump back down there. Let's go ahead and jump, jump, jump. We gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go fast. We gotta jump down there. Okay, so we're here. Okay, okay. Hey, hey, hey. I need that armor. Wait, are you the same guy that was giving me the armor? Or it was one of them. It was one of them. Okay, so let's see if they will give me any armor. I don't think so. I highly doubt it. Oh, he's giving me armor. Okay, so as you can see, servers aren't completely activated here. It is a little bit laggy, but we're gonna go ahead and pick up all this armor. So he's giving me a bunch of things to go ahead and start off my island. So I'm not exactly sure if this is a lot. Look at all the stuff he's giving me. This is crazy, guys. Okay, so I'm able to go ahead and pick up all this stuff, I think. Can I can I pick it up? Um, okay, yeah, I'm picking it up slowly. So yeah, apparently, yes, yeah, servers aren't without their problems, but I got all the items, which is great, guys. So that is actually pretty insane. Let's go ahead and say thank you. Okay, now I can use the slash spawn command. Okay, so let's go ahead and create our island. Okay, so I'm guessing the command slash is is gonna allow me. Oh, this is actually a pretty cool GUI. So I can create my island. It's even giving me options. So we have the option between destroyed outpost, basic outpost, and advanced outpost. You already know me. Let's go ahead and do the advanced outpost real quick. Okay, never mind. Since we don't have any ranks, we're going to have to use the destroyed outpost. So let's go ahead and create that. Just go ahead and create it real quick. And our island is here. So this is actually pretty cool, guys. So we get a bunch of things to go ahead and start off with for an island. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so we need to first start off by placing the sapling. So let's go ahead and get that started. So the sapling should grow. Or actually, you know what? Let's not grow the sapling right there. As you can see, very laggy stuff. Actually, we got it in a decent amount of time. But it's not the best response times that I've seen on the server. So I want to go ahead and place it there because it may be easier to go ahead and chop it down and then get all the food from it, such as apples and things like that. I'm going to put the old armor in here because we don't need it. Okay, so I'm going to attempt to make one of these cobblestone generators. I'm not exactly sure on how to make it, but let's go ahead and see if we can get it the first time. So let's go ahead and break this, break this, and then break here. And then let's go ahead and place a block in the middle or... I forgot exactly how these were made. Like, this is why Skyblock is, like, the most unfriendly game mode that you can actually play. Because it's so hard to get into if you don't know, like, the basic mechanics of, like, a cobblestone generator. And just basic mechanics of survival. But let's go ahead and try to do this. Okay, so I think I have made the cobblestone generator. So I have the water flowing there. 
And then I'm guessing I should have the lava flowing like that. I think that may be the case right here. So I'm going to let the lava flow and then it might do it. I have no idea, guys. It's been a while since I played Skyblock. That's where the cobblestone is supposed to go ahead and make itself. I'm not exactly sure, guys. Okay, so I think I actually have done it, guys. This is actually pretty insane. So right here, we have our cobblestone generator. I'm going to go ahead and get my cobblestone real quick. And as you can see, it's going to regenerate. Or no, it just made the... I'm so confused, guys. Okay, so I'm still trying to struggle on this cobblestone generator. Skyblock is just not for me. Oh, oh no, it's back. It's back. Okay, so no, it's the server lagging on that part. But I'm guessing it turns into stone on this server. So the automatic... Oh, is that an ore? Guys, okay, this is super cool. Okay, so we actually just got an iron... Oh, it went into the lava. So I decided to go ahead and get a little bit closer. So I'm guessing it's going to go to me. So it keeps going into... Okay, so maybe it could be the server. Let's go ahead and check on our tree. Oh, it's still not grown. Well, we'll come back to that one. So I thought it was going to be a GUI shop, guys. So I typed in the command slash shop. And it actually brought me here. So this is actually pretty cool. This is kind of like my realms that I used to host. Which, they will be back eventually, guys. But, hackers, you know how they be sometimes. But, let's go ahead and take a look at what we can go ahead and possibly buy. Guys, this is a super cool feature that they have on the server. I had no idea. So you can buy minions. That is really, really cool. I'm still looking for hoppers, but I just found that randomly. I had no idea what an SP. What, what the heck is an SP? But uh, it seems like it's a really cool idea that they have here. And it is a GUI shop, but I really thought like if you were to type in slash shop like that, it wouldn't like teleport you here. I really thought it was going to be like an instant GUI that you could pull up in your island. But I respect it though. You can go ahead and do slash IS to go back to your island really easy. They have a crazy amount of spawners that I can't afford. Okay, so I decided to go ahead and buy a diamond hoe because I actually need one of these. So let's go ahead and get it. Uh, we don't have enough money. Never mind. Wait, what? You could hit these shops. Okay, that is actually extreme. I thought they would have banned this. Look at this, guys. Look at this. This is actually insane. So right before, since I have fire aspect, this is so true. This is such a troll right here. Okay, so I can't find the hoppers and we can't afford anything in the shop. So let's go back to our island and then let's go ahead and come up with a game plan. Go to island and we are back. Okay, so our tree is still not grown. Okay, what the heck? But hold on, wait a minute. So you guys are probably curious on how I'm actually accessing these servers. It is actually pretty easy. Go ahead and click on play. Then go over to friends, and then you guys should see a land games. There's two different methods on how to go ahead and do this. I did an in-depth video, and I'll go ahead and put a screenshot of the video so you could see what it was, and then you guys can go ahead and check it out. And I'll leave it linked down in the comment section of how to join servers for Minecraft PS4 Bedrock Edition. It's actually a really good tutorial, and it goes in-depth on how to join Bedrock Edition servers, any server that you want. Along with that, even showing you how to join Java Edition servers. So the first method is actually going to be pocket pocket mine mp so as you can see my pocket mine server actually popped up here and then when i go ahead and click on it then i'm able to go ahead and join it so it's just an application on your android phone i know what you're probably saying in the comment section how are you able to go ahead and do this on an ios device and the sad truth about that is there's no method to go ahead and do it but there is a way to go ahead and do it on your windows 10 pc so go ahead and look at my video i'll leave it linked down in the comment section below but if you guys want a quick over view of the ip it's pretty simple let's go ahead and press up on the d-pad and the command should pop up so right here is the ip so all you need to do is slash transfer server and then go ahead and space and then play dot imperials dot net so it's actually pretty simple and then as soon as i press square i should be able to go ahead and run the command and it's working it is working and i am going to be loading into the server right now so i'll go ahead and meet you guys back in the original video but as you can see this is actually a pretty good server for ps4 and i think this is pretty underrated i really enjoying this video this is like one of my favorite times of minecraft in like the past month and this was like the only time that i played minecraft in the past month so i mean that's saying something but let's go ahead and break all of this we can probably expand a little bit and i want to definitely get this all leveled down like this but i'm really confused on why this hasn't grown yet I know it only needs like one block to go ahead and grow a tree, just one block of dirt and then you're all good to go. But for some reason it's still not grown, which is actually confusing me. 
But anyways, this is going to probably wrap it up for today's video. So hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time on the next video. Bye.